First, I feel like I need to change the shape of my nose. So I'm taking this scar wax from Ben Nye. Um, this doesn't make a big difference like prosthetics, but it's going to make enough difference that I need for this video. So I'm just going to make my nose a bit longer and the nostrils wider. Now I can apply the foundation. So I'm taking Touch and Soul Advanced Real Moisture Liquid Foundation. This has SPF 30. I'm just going to bounce it and slowly blend it all over with my Beauty Blender. Um, I also gotta remember not to mess up my nose, so just lightly dab. Next, I'm gonna sculpt the face. I know this step looks very similar in every transformation video, but it's just a slight difference of where I'm placing the contour and highlight. Um, for the cheekbones, I'm going a bit under, and then her face is overall kind of small, so I'm gonna darken the corners of my face a bit more than usual. Then I'm just gonna blend the concealer and then the contour, get that arm workout. For setting, I'm going to use Mana Kadar Cosmetics HD Perfecting Powder first. So this is going to set that creamy concealer, make it nice and matte. Um, and around the face, I'm going over with a darker powder foundation. For the brows, I feel like they need to be quite high because she has that surprised brow look. Um, so it's going to be rounded but with a soft arch. Final touch for the brows is applying this Multi-Perfection Duo Brow Powder um, by Nomad Cosmetics on top to make it look more full and defined. I'm starting the eye makeup now, so first I'm using the base color. She usually does like a brown eye with a lighter cut crease. So once that's done, I'm going to take the creamy concealer and then just carve out the crease. On top of the cut crease, I'm going to apply this pinky peach eyeshadow. So with the lighter base, this color is really going to pop. Now to darken the eye makeup, I'm taking Naked Cosmetics, a Mother Nature number no. 06 pigment. Um, it's this really beautiful brown, so I'm going to apply it on the corners and also on the lower lash line. Now I'm going to line the eyes and this is my favorite gel liner at the moment. It's from M Cosmetics. So I'm going to line the lower lash line first and then go over on the upper lash line. False lashes, I'm taking this cat eye shaped lashes from Huda Beauty. So it's shorter in the inner corners and then it gets longer on the outer. And I'm going to finish off the eye makeup using Benefit Cosmetics Their Real Lengthening and Volumizing Mascara. Round two with contouring. So I'm taking my powder contour and making the lines underneath her eyes more visible. Um, I'm also going to darken the sides of my face and my cheekbones. Before I do the lips, I need to highlight. So I'm taking Barfly Highlighter in Candlelit from Teeny Beauty. I'm applying it to make the cheekbones glow and also make the cheeks fuller. Finally, I'm going to reshape the lips so the cupid's bow is going to be more rounded and further apart. But the lips are still nice and full. Um, after that, I'm going to apply Makes Cream Luminous Lip Gloss in Abalone. And that is my full Cardi B transformation. I just love how real she is. And this is me pretending to rant like her. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And until next time, bye.